Hey everyone, this is Ron with the walkthrough video tour of 7842 Montview Road in North Charleston, South Carolina. This home is incredibly convenient to everything. Uh, it sits very close to the Air Force Base at only about two miles away, uh, which also is the airport, Charleston International Airport. So if you have a um, need to be at either one of those places for travel or for the Air Force, certainly this is gonna be a convenient spot for you. Um, it's a lovely home, you know, North Charleston, and being off of Dorchester Road, you're very close to get to Somerville. You're close to get to downtown Charleston. It took me about 15 minutes to get here from downtown. Um, and then to get out to Isle of Palms and Sullivan's Island, that's probably, you know, and Folly Beach. Those are going to be your longer hikes at probably 30 to 40 minutes, depending on traffic. Uh, but, you know, that's going all the way to the coast. Uh, but the rest of Charleston, incredibly convenient right here, kind of at your doorstep. Do a quick pan of the neighborhood, a couple of important things. The mailbox bank sits right over there, very close to your front door. So that's where you'd get your mail. Got a little retention pond across the street here, um, which is nice, very scenic for, you know, just being kind of in the area. And then here is just kind of a quick glance at the neighborhood incredibly quiet um, very picturesque on this beautiful charleston day let's go take a look inside you do have two dedicated parking spaces right here <clears throat> and a little porch as we walk in this home is a three bed two and a half bath it's been upgraded with lots of cool stuff let's go check it out you know, starting out right here in the entryway, you've got this nice little banister. The bedrooms are carpeted. You do have this beautiful washed white wood flooring downstairs through the living areas. Uh, as you come in the front door here, here's some of the cool features I wanted to show you. This is a formal, well, truthfully, you can use it for whatever you want. This could be a formal dining space. It could be a playroom. It could be a home office. Either way, you have this super cool light up overhead. I am six feet tall and I'm walking underneath this uh, with no problem. It, it does sit a little bit low. It looks like it was meant to be a dining lamp, but for clearance sake, again, it's more than six feet off the ground. Um, also in this room, take a closer look here, super cool wallpaper throughout the entire room. Um, so that's really nice. These walls in the hall here are painted. Um, it's a nice like kind of sea foam, a very light sea foam green. Um, it's almost just a, an off-white. Um, just showing you this for space, lots of storage under the stairs. You do have a coat rack in this closet for coats. I forgot to mention this. Your actual coat closet for when you come in that front door is here. Um, and that's, you know, a, a full-size coat closet. Okay, the half bath that services the downstairs is here. It's good size, nice big oval mirror there, lighting. Um, and then you have another big utility closet here, with a linen closet, if you will, um, plenty of storage space within that closet. As you come out here, again, really funky wallpaper. Super cool. I like it a lot. You can get a close-up look at that. But this kind of just borders uh, the dining area or eating kitchen area, should I say. Again, you have a pendant lamp hanging over this area. This one does sit a little bit lower uh, at about five and a half feet. Um, so you would want to probably situate a dining table under that. But here, check out this giant wide open space. Beautiful kitchen. We'll take a closer look there in a second. Dining area and then your living space. Here, the back, the back door has a screened in porch, but the um, owners have situated a one of these magnetic screen doors. 
so you just pull it apart, but you can, um, on a nice day like it is today outside, you can just open up that um, screened in area. I do want to go ahead and show you the back porch because there's something really cool back here. One second. Okay, sorry about that, going out this. There's a little screened in porch as I mentioned, but check this out. They've situated a little pet door uh, that when unlatched, the pet can go in and out of that and they have a look at the little gated um, area here for using the potty and whatnot. Um, but that's pretty cool, I thought. But again, screened in patio, nice and pleasant out here, no bugs. Um, so there's the screened in porch. Okay, let us check out the kitchen. Just, you know, again, with this wide open plan, you're going to have your living space set up here, lots of room to um, set that up and segue right here into the kitchen. Here's your countertop. I did not get a close-up shot of these, so hopefully everybody's getting to take a look at this amazing video. You have these pendant lamps up over the island. Lots and lots of cabinet space. Your dishwasher here next to the sink. Lowers all the way around. Stove oven combo with microwave and vent hood up above. French door refrigerator freezer with indoor ice and water. Your pantry is here. Um, the backsplash around the kitchen, do a close up on this. You have those glass um, subway tiles. The color kind of matches a little bit darker than what you see for the paint um, around, as I mentioned, just a slightly off green um, look there. All right, that's the downstairs. Let's go and check out upstairs. Again, carpet throughout the bedrooms. Nice light gray. Um, at the top, you have a little bit of a bonus space right here. Um, again, for whatever you need it for, but could easily be an office or a play area, or, you know, just if you just need a little bit of extra space. You have, um, a closet at the top here, linen closet there, linen closet there, and just off of all the bedrooms, you have your uh, full-size washer dryer uh, laundry room right here. And again, this is in the uh, the main area as you come to the top of the steps. Two guest bedrooms there. Primary suite is here. So this one looks out towards the front. I'm just gonna kind of walk around the room here to give you a feel. You do have the vaulted, slightly vaulted ceilings here. Give you a little bit more space. Here we have a walk-in closet with racks that go all the way around. There's that. And then here is your primary suite bath. Hi everyone. You've got the dual sinks, um, granite countertops in here, plenty of cabinet space, mirror that goes all the way across, towel racks, and then here's your private, there's a, a door that closes this area off, uh, private bath, big garden tub with a little lounger seat back there, um, and a rain shower head up above. This, uh, this is tiled in here for your reference. Okay, last but certainly not least, the two guest bedrooms and the bathroom that services those rooms. Here is bedroom number one. Both bedrooms have a good size uh, French door closet there, um, but plenty of space in here. Here's the bathroom directly across. Uh, you know, single sink, but lots of counter space, two cabinets, big mirror, uh, and then there's your tub, shower tub combo. And again, tiled in that room. And then just to the right, we have the second uh, guest bedroom. 
and here's that. Okay, everybody, I want to thank you for watching. This has been the walkthrough tour of 7842 Montview Road in North Charleston, South Carolina. For more information on this property, please give us a call at 843-608-8845 or go to our website at happyhomespm.com. Thanks for watching.